tell me you were an actor, Desmond? Uh, no, it's actually set design for the Royal Shakespeare Company. Impressive. You didn't graduate from university? No, sir. I had to look after my three brothers after my father. Any military experience? No, sir. She's beautiful. Your boat. My foundation is sponsoring a solo race around the world. Something wrong? No. No, sir. Well, Desmond, I'm going to see to it that you have a position in our administrative department. Not the most glamorous duty, but it's a start. I'll speak to human resources. Ah, uh, with all due respect, sir. I haven't come here to interview for a position in your company. You haven't? No, sir. I came here to ask for your daughter's hand in marriage. We've been together two years now, and the pen's moving in, and I love her. But your permission would mean everything to me. I'm impressed, Hume. Very noble gesture. You know anything about whiskey? Uh, no, I'm afraid not, sir. This is a 60-year McCutcheon, named after Anderson McCutcheon, esteemed admiral from the Royal Navy. He retired with more medals than any man before or since. Moved to the Highlands to see out his remaining years. Admiral McCutcheon was a great man, Hume. This was his crowning achievement. This swallow is worth more than you could make in a month. And to share it with you would be a waste and a disgrace to the great man who made it. Because you, Hume, will never be a great man. Mr. Whitmore. I know I'm not. What you're not is worthy of drinking my whiskey. How could you ever be worthy of my daughter? <laughs> 